So it's only fitting that I start my day out with a tea. And today's selection is red raspberry leaf tea. You know, ladies, this is our go-to tea. It's always good for that yoni health, as well as your uterus and all of your womanly working parts. Of course, I have to add my raw honey, baby. It is not a tea without honey. I mean, it is, but I love honey with my tea. So... Of course, this is going to be my addition. Also, I'm going to go ahead and make me a nice little snack. This is an elevated, what I like to call my elevated version of avocado toast. And I'm using a chopped salad, which I'm going to continue to use all of its toppings as well as the dressing. And I'm going to toast me some bread and cream some avocado down. And it's just going to make for a very lovely, rich, fresh snack. And these are the toppings that I'm going to use. Yes, I love me some extra crunch, so I'm going to add a trail mix. You can eat it just like this in like salad form, or you can do what I did and turn it into a lovely avocado toast. And yes, it's topped with ginger. Yes, the same type of ginger that you use for sushi. Don't knock it until you try it, I'm telling you. I was so ecstatic and grateful that Carlos brought this bed up the steps for me because it was so freaking heavy. I mean, so heavy. But anyways, I literally envisioned this bed for the boys. And I knew that if it didn't work out, it would literally have to get here to the house. I would have to unbox it, put it together, and then decide that it does not work out because my mind was dead set on this one. Of majority of the room which is fine um but yeah it does take up a lot of space in here but they needed their own little space and of course there's plenty of places to play throughout the house um so yeah My mom always come through with so many surprises. I'm so blessed to have chosen her as my mother in this lifetime. She gifted me her old patio set, which I'm so grateful for because it worked out perfectly and it looks so beautiful. And babe, what better day than a day that is just for me? It's my mommy's night, no kids, baby, I am kid free. And let me tell you, this was just the icing on the cake for me. I needed this space. This is my space, okay, to just relax and chill. Not to say that the boys will not have access to it because we know they will. But, baby, this definitely has my name all over it. Anyways, I finished my night out for myself, vibing out some music, took me a spiritual bath. Baby, you couldn't tell me nothing. This time to reset is always much needed. And if you're a mama out there, baby, get your view time in. everybody sha girl i thought i would come on here and cook for you guys because i am about to cook so i'm gonna do this butter chickpea and veggies with sweet potatoes and spinach over 
this seven grains rice now these are technically microwave meals if you like to use a microwave but we don't do no microwaves over here so okay we're gonna do the skillet version of each one the stove top and the skillet version using our new cookware okay so i'm also going to i don't know if y'all have these where y'all live but these chopped kits it's like a little salad chopped kits they have different flavors. I can show y'all some of the other flavors that I have. Um, this is like my go-to. I love them so much. But I used to just eat them just like this, right out of the bag, clean it off, and let that be that. But I started cooking them, like actually cooking the contents on a pan with a little bit of oil and then I season it. And y'all, the cooked version is so bussing. The kids can eat it, it's very tender. Um, this right here is a little bit harder for the kids to eat. And then it's, it's really not as um, pleasant because it does have um, pieces of cabbage in it. And you know, cabbage is kind of like a funky um, vegetable or leafy vegetable. So they don't really care for it. And it has a lot of it in there. But y'all, when you cook it down, it is so yummy. Like. Y'all, thank me later. Thank me later. Are y'all missing? Yeah, you're missing. Both boys are not feeling very well. They're both like booger nose boys. I've wiped their nose so They have had a nose wipe so many times, I can barely keep up and count. But they haven't been feeling very well. So they're very runny nose like. So I went to the dentist today. Um, and uh, found out that I have a few cavities. <laughs> I have a few cavities in the back, but they told me uh, my teeth are really good. I take good care of them. And they're probably like something that's kind of happened over time. The last time I went to the dentist was probably in like 2020 when I was pregnant with Solar. Um, 2021 when I was pregnant with Solar. But I just went for a consultation because I'm going to get some work done. You know what I'm saying? Um, not really work, but just, you know, fix my teeth, regular teeth health. But, um, I was talking to the dentist and he referred me to an orthodontist and told me that he would recommend that I get braces just for the long run. You know what I'm saying? Like I got a major overbite and then my gap, I have a lot of gaps in my teeth, which there's nothing wrong with that. You know what I'm saying? But personally I am about taking care of myself so i'm going to um do that and that i guess is considered cosmetic work i don't know but i don't want to close my gap but i do want to close the other gaps in my teeth um i think my gap just makes me me like that's my thing it has gotten bigger over time and um like when i look at other pictures it has gotten bigger over time which you know not a big deal or anything but i'm going to go to the consultation i'm gonna see what they're talking about and yeah so yeah that's what i'm gonna be doing now girl put your clothes down girl put your clothes down put your clothes down i always gotta sneak and dance y'all with my kids not watching because i got little boys and we definitely don't want them you know what i'm saying that's one thing i was just telling carlos like the other day like i really love my kids but having little boys really make you more how can I say it? Hard than you maybe want to be. Hold on, what? My bad. I wore my bag today that my sister got me when I went to my dentist appointment. Y'all seen a little baby pouch and hang back? <laughs> it's not that bad though. You can see it there. <laughs> it's not that bad though. And don't worry about me. Worry about yourself. Worry about yourself, baby. Don't be worried about nobody else but yourself. <laughs> but yourself. But yourself. But yourself. But yourself. I'm shiny. Anyways, let's get the cooking. This is the bag that I wore today that my sister gave me for my birthday, Blue Creations, baby, Blue Creations. Just don't play with it, don't play with it, don't play with her, okay? This is part of the sister collection, okay? Yes, 
yes filling it filling it filling it filling it killing it yeah all of it it is handmade it's exclusive all of the things like don't play with me this is how i was out earlier today doing what i had to get done you know what i'm saying doing what i had to get done I ain't gonna lie to y'all i did have my little my coattails pop because i don't know it's just an energy like what you mean what you talking about <laughs> what you what you talking about what you talking 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 about what you talking what you talking what you talking of course i was out without my kids though i did grocery shop today but i instacarted everything from the fresh market and um aldi the fresh market and aldi and i found out that aldi is actually european you guys it's actually originated from um over in europe and um there are aldi's everywhere over there and lidl's too lidl and aldi if you have them in your area so you just know that well they're only on the east coast that's what i actually found out too she told me they're only on the east coast but yeah big boy stuff this is my salad mixer really easy to use get your salad of choice or your greens of choice There are just certain things that I refuse to do, like that I know now that I'm like in my adult, you know, and one of them is like tearing open packages, like with my mouth, like, no, I'm just gonna go get a pair of scissors. You know what I'm saying? Like that was something I would do in my more immature days. Like <laughs> I'm using scissors now. I have class, okay? I've grown, I've come a long way. Okay, we're using scissors now. I'm not using my mouth to do that, like no. Like, we care now. What is that about? I don't know, but I'm here for it. What is that about? I don't know, but I'm here for it. I'm just spinning it with the water in there. The water is in there on the spin. It's just to kind of help spin it out. So, yeah. Um. Just put y'all on to how I do a few things. How I do a few things. Mmm. That's good. I don't even think I need to season it. I think y'all don't. I don't think I need to season it. That's so good. I don't think I need to season it. That says a lot. And so now we're going to do the same thing with the rice. We're going to break it up. These rice cakes be so good, y'all, I'm telling you. I mean, they be so good. Don't take long to cook either. You just need a little, little bit of water with this. This has been my most recent drinking water of choice. I really have to go to Whole Foods and just order them by the box. Um, Yeah. But because of the plastic, I really don't want to keep drinking out of plastic. So like this right here is gonna start being a little expensive, but it's okay for the sake of some things that I want to be healthy about. So, and because I mixed this with my children's water, I mean their juice cups as well, I'm just gonna put a little bit in a cup. So, since living with my mom for a little bit, my kids be asking about their pee pop all the time now. Cheers, we're having water. Oh, that's good. It's gonna be even better with a lemon. Yes, baby, yes, baby, yes, baby. Help. What's wrong? Yum, yum, yum. Let's wake this water up a little bit. Look it up, we're gonna wake it up a little bit more. So my is absorbing that stuff. Just waking it up. Ooh, stop, don't play with me. <laughs> Ooh, don't play with me. If I wasn't on here with y'all, I would be here dancing and jamming. Oh shoot, it said don't let it boil. I'm gonna use a drop of grapeseed oil, okay, in the pan. 
that's not really a drop because I like my my um I like my cabbage and my vegetables nice and oiled and fried a little bit. Um, that's just my preference. You can cook them how you want to. I probably took all the minerals out of mine. <laughs> I probably do. Why not use a little lemon squeeze, right? You can use a little lemon squeeze in there. Wouldn't be a bad idea. Ooh, baby. Yo, you know you happy when you just sing out of nowhere, okay? You know those spirits are high and uplifting. Uplifted. Okay, uplifted. You okay? Ooh, we're being generous. What kind of generosity? Generosity kills the cat. Generosity kills the cat. What am I doing? Just gonna put a little bit of that in there. And then heat it up, baby, up, baby. Just heat it up. We're gonna add this. There you go, blue. And we're gonna let it cook. That's what that thing said to do. Mmm. Mmm. That's good. I feel like a butterfly that can just flap its wings and fly right the freak up out of here. New plant. I got this new plant. I'm not gonna get too close to my food, but I'm gonna talk to y'all from back here. I got this new plant yesterday when I went um, on my little haul. Now I know I told y'all in my last live, I was gonna show y'all me I'm going on my little haul, but some things happened, y'all. And I, for, I just got excited and put everything up beforehand. So that's what happened. But Auntie J had sent me a gift card to a store of my choice. And of course I chose Urban Outfitters because they have a lot of cute just like home decor stuff. So I had purchased a few things off of there um, that should be arriving sometime next week. And one of those things was a planter, a mushroom planter. It was super cute for my new plant. And so she'll just be hanging out in, it, in this, her original um, tan until her new planter comes so then she can make her roots and make herself comfortable. The other plant that I got is outside right now, but because I'm cooking, I'm just gonna give it a second before I head out there to show you guys what it looks like. <laughs> oh my gosh, I tripped myself out. Hmm? It looks delish. So this is our cooked chopped salad. It has kale and carrots and cabbage. Look at that. Purple cabbage in there. So beautiful. It even has some green onions. Look. Some green onions are in there too. Yummy. And so I seasoned that. And then over here we have our seven grains rice. Ooh, yummy, that's gonna be so good. That's gonna be so good. We're just gonna let that cook for a little bit. And then over here, ooh, that looks like a stew. Does that not look like a stew? Does that not look like a stew? Oh my gosh. And it looks so rich. Oh my goodness, I'm so excited. I'm so excited about everything. I love cooking. I love cooking when I'm not, when it's not a chore. Does that make sense? Does that make sense? Like if it's a night where I know I want to chill and I just want to relax. Okay. So it's some fries. That's all I have in my freezer for you. Um, throw together a little bread and avocado toast, baby. You know. We're so full of gratitude. We're so full of life, peace, love, and all things beautiful. Let's get that good old energy flowing and going. Let's light some good old paleo song to. Why not? Let's get that good old energy flowing and going. And I keep a window cracked up in here, baby. Window stay open, okay? Window, window, keep the energy flowing, baby. Good, okay? <laughs> No issues up in here. My kids are happy. I'm happy. They chilling. I'm chilling. 
I mean, out of this and then that right there because it's the only two pieces of dishware that I have for like eating out of. And um, Carlos did bring me some paper plates, but I just feel like there's, I don't know, in my mind, there are little microscopic paper bugs all on this waiting for my food to get on it. It moistens up and gets like very soggy easily um, once the food starts sweating and you know, like the heat from the food and I just can't imagine like eating bugs knowingly like I know that they're if somebody took a microscope to that paper they would see the bugs and I just don't want them so I've been eating out of this now I do put the boys fruit on that plate um I will put them some fruit on the plate something that's not like hot you know um and you still add all your toppings you still add all of your toppings to it. Mmm. Mmm. Thank me later. Thank me later. You're gonna wanna. I'm gonna use this as a plate as well. Because why not? It's gonna go into this bowl. Y'all, oh my gosh, it's so good. Yeah, that always tastes so amazing. What's going on, boy? My kids are going to eat with me because they do so often. So I'm just going to put all the food in these bowls and pour our stuff right over the top. Because stop playing. Mm, 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 mm. Mm. We about to smash, you hear me? 